Yeah, I can see the the stereotypes that we might bring into a relationship that uh, a man has to earn more or a man doesn't do housework and that's just the way it, it's just mm -hmm. the way it is and that if i brought that into a relationship that's not great and that's that would that would be something i could address internally yes and then and and once again if we take that whole well a man has to make a certain amount of money does he because i know relationships where there are women who make, who are the breadwinners in those relationships. Now, are they as popular? No, but look at what women have had to go through historically. Women are still not getting paid the same amount as men, even when they work in the same fields. So, you know, there, there's still that that needs to be, you know, dealt with. But above and beyond that, let's focus on the more important things. And I'm not saying that money isn't important because it is, it's, it ranks with uh, infidelity as the number one, number two reasons for most divorces. However, what I am saying is what would happen if more people began to focus on what they can give in a relationship as compared to what they're going to receive mm -hmm. and focus on, I want to give so much love and so much joy. And sometimes that may come out, you know, in a financial way, and maybe it will come out in other ways. What would happen if we were to focus on going into another person's life and just showing up and being our very best and just giving and giving? And if you're giving, what happens? You attract another person that's giving. And so there can be this balance of giving and receiving. But there's so much of, of just animosity about so many different things. So everybody kind of like has this wall up and this guard of, I don't want to be taken advantage of. And I understand it. And I'm saying, let's move past the wall. Let's figure out what's going on so that we can lower the wall and we can move forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it sounds, it sounds pretty amazing to, to go into a relationship expecting to give rather than waiting and expecting to receive and to be given to because that other person might not give you exactly what you think you want. And sometimes they end up giving you things you didn't know you needed. Mm -hmm. That that happens as well. So it's all about perspective and, and what we're willing to do, who we're willing to be in our own lives first, and then in our relationships.